This is tutorial 1-3 in GIS Tutorial 1 Basic Workbook. And this tutorial picks up right where 1-2 left off, and we're going to learn how to navigate in a map document now. The first tool we're going to learn is the Zoom In button. Uh, right here you want to come up on the toolbar and choose the magnifying glass with the plus sign. And we're going to zoom in to Florida. Say we zoomed in too much though, we can go and next to it is the zoom out button. You want to create another square and we will zoom out. Now that's good for getting in the general area, but once you get close to where you want, you might want to use the fix zoom in and the fix zoom out. So now we're going to just continue to click on this and it will zoom us in at a set rate. As you can see, I've lost the tip of Florida, so I'm going to use the fix zoom out. And now we have the full state in view pretty closely, but it's not centered. So what we're going to do is we're going to click on our pan tool, which is the little hand, and we can center it. Now what we want to do is we want to go back to our full extent which is this little globe here. This will bring us out to where we can see everything. But say you only wanted to check something um, and you wanted to go back you can just click on this arrow which brings you to the previous extent. Now this works a lot like the undo redo button that you've used in like Word or, or other programs like that. If we click on the go to next extent it'll bring us to um, back to the full extent because that was the one uh, we, we used from the previous. It stores it pretty much like a little book. So we want to finish with being on the full extent. Now what they want us to do is they want us to zoom in to Colorado and more into the streets that are in Jefferson. So we can use our zoom in magnifying glass and that'll bring us into the state. And then we can zoom in to our streets. And then we can use our pan to center it. Now we're going to go back to full extent because there's another way of doing this. If I right click on Colorado streets and I go to zoom to layer, it will zoom as closely as it can get to where everything is showing and it will have it centered. This is a very useful tool when uh, working with shape files. Okay, with that done, what we're going to learn now is how to use the magnifying tool. You want to go up to Windows and you want to use Magnifier. I'm just going to move this over here. And as you can see, whatever we put over it zooms in. And we can change our percentage here. We can go up to a thousand if we wanted to. Uh, we can go and we can also change the magnified by in the the properties window. We'll leave it at 800. And that's it for the magnifier. Um, I don't really use it that often. Uh, normally, if I need to see something, I zoom in and look at it. Now what we want to do is we want to go to a full extent. And we want to zoom in up here to include about three of the states. That's good right there. And now they want us to go up to window again. And they want us to do overview. And what it does is it shows us 
what we're seeing in relation to everything else. And you can click on that and you can drag it and put it in other areas towards the same exact extent of your view. Um, this is our, ex our, our view extent. As you can see why I move it, it does not change. Uh, this is another tool why in some cases can be helpful, but I have never really used it that much. Uh, but then what we're going to learn next is actually a very useful tool that I've used a number of times. We're going to go back to full extent. We're going to zoom in to Florida. And what we're going to do is we're going to go up to bookmarks and we're going to create, we're going to call it Florida. And they want us to do it to another, a few other states. Uh, we're just going to do uh, a few. So you want to go to uh, full extent. You want to zoom in to say New York. Bookmarks create New York. Now we can go to full extent. Now say we we're working with a lot of areas and you like the extents just right once you get to that extent you cre can create a bookmark and then by clicking on bookmarks you go to florida and it will bring you to that exact extent that you you enjoy working with and we can go to new york and you can create a lot of these if you're working with different areas and they're very helpful to get rid of them you can just go to manage and you can just remove. I'm just gonna remove all. And then we're done. And that's it for this tutorial.